uh, Simply Holy here, and um, today I wanted to review um, basically, I guess also a how to, how I got my hair like this. Now, I might be insane because I am um, 41 years old and I've dyed my hair pink. So, I don't know what this says about me, but here we are. So, <laughs> So this is going to be a two part video. The first part is about the bleach and how I did it and a um, review of it. And then the second part is about the coloring portion um, and how I felt about it and what I think of it all. So um, the first thing I have is the um, Colorista bleach all over kit is what I used to bleach my hair. And um, I actually used two boxes and you'll see that in the video. Um, and I guess, you know, let's go to the video and see how it goes. Okay guys, so this is everything that comes in the kit. You've got um, your directions, some gloves, the mixes, and a conditioner. And this is just the directions telling you um, basically what to do to lighten the bottom of your hair first and then do your roots if you're going to, and then use the conditioner. Um, so that is everything that comes in the box. And this is some foil I had pre-prepared for my hair, which you'll see later. Then you just mix the ingredients. And here am I with my insane hair, and that was my um, husband's arm. He just thought he was so funny. Anyway, so here you can see my crazy hair. I had put it up into insane ponytails because I had seen a video. Actually, it was L'Oreal's. Um, colorista bleach video that gave me this idea um, she had the girl she had put her hair up like this um, so it kind of gave it like an ombre look and I thought that's what I would try because why not I've bleached my hair before and I had failed to get all the hairs anyway so I thought maybe this will be faster I can bleach all my hair make sure I get everything more saturated because um, that's a huge thing like when you're doing your hair to be able to get all the strands saturated and even by doing this I still missed a lot of pieces. Um, my hair is insanely thick, you guys. So everything that I do takes a million times longer, which is why I needed two boxes of bleach and not just one. So I started like by their instructions and kind of did the bottoms first and then kind of went up to the top. You can see it's kind of already lightening my hair, which is awesome. And once I did that strand and thought it was as um, saturated as I could, I wrapped foil around it. I had seen or read somewhere that that helps keep the um, bleach cold, or not cold, helps keep the bleach um, from drying out, so that it'll continue to activate and lighten your hair. And I will say, I think that it worked extremely well. Um, I will say that this is not a look that I would normally go for, and I'm not sure that you should go for it either, but I mean, hey, if you want to rock it, you should rock it. Um, but I think that the color worked out really nicely. Um, you'll see at the end of this video, I kind of do a little hair twirl and feel all fancy. Um, but just in general, I think this bleach worked pretty well. It's worked better than um, a different bleach I tried in the past. Um, I can't remember what that one was, but it was pretty awful. I had um, also used two boxes. It actually did bleach my hair twice in a row, and it did not get as light as it does in this one. So I think that this is a really good kit. Um, it gave me some really good coverage. Um, you know, everything that happened was mostly my fault. It did have, um, the pieces that did get extremely saturated did get really light, almost white, just like the box, which is insane for my hair because my hair is so dark and so thick. I was just extremely impressed. I, I would really, if I was buying a bleach, I'd probably do this one again. Um, and here I am showing off my hair because I am so cool and fancy <laughs> and you can see how damaged my hair is um, from the bleach and I think it worked pretty good. I mean, I kind of liked the crazy ponytail look technique, even with my hair like this, I think it looks kind of cute and you can see I definitely had some unevenness um, when I was applying it and um, yeah, but I think it worked out okay and the shampoo they gave you the purple shampoo actually worked pretty well. My hair was definitely brassier before I um, washed it, and I think it worked out. Um, the shampoo was really helpful. 
Hi guys, thanks so much for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the how-to um, and I just want to give you know my final thoughts on it. Um, I actually enjoyed the bleach. Um, I don't know if you can enjoy bleach, but I actually enjoyed this product. I have uh, previously bleached my hair before and it was a freaking disaster. Um, I'm not going to insert a photo of it because it's just terrible. My hair is completely orange. Um, yeah, so I actually did like how this um, turned out on me. Um, I was pretty excited about it. My hair was completely fried, but that's to be expected from bleach, um, which is also one of the reasons I didn't go up to my roots because I was afraid of my hair falling out. <laughs> um, so that is my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you are interested in seeing the part two, please stay tuned for part two, um, hopefully coming up on Thursday. Thanks guys. Bye.